Anyway, uh, we got uh, Morven here. And uh, this is a usable, this is an okay starting hand. Not bad. Not sure what we want to kick here. Maybe a uh, hound. Yeah, this is good. Also, we are going first. I, I kind of like going first. So, does he have some kind of reveal strategy? There's an okay chance that he's gonna lock that. I, I guess I could have started with Knackers. But Imbrad is just so damn strong. Anyway, I would definitely recommend starting with Knackers usually. The music is so chill. Sure. I miss the old hunting music. Is there a way to switch to it? I very much prefer that. No. Yes. More random enemies. Come on, tank it, Imbralit. He's fucking champ. Take it three times in a row. Ah. He did, he did the best he could. Oh my god, he got strong now. Damn. <laughs> okay. Um, play Count Coldwell. No. Play Vivas Incantation. Eat Count Coldwell. And uh, we're just gonna have to punish that. Having duty again, oh gods. <laughs> what? Bloody random. Okay, let's play the Vault Hunt Hunt for two reasons. Uh, it'll, it'll buff the Necker, but not if I play it later. And uh, I kind of want to get rid of the Mangle now. <clears throat> I didn't play Gwent for uh, a long time. I'm not even sure if the, the rank we're playing at is, is like any good. Is it any good? I'm not sure. I suppose I need to climb up higher. I'm just... Well... I guess I'm gonna learn. It's actually very tempting to play the Rider now. So we play the Rider, but I will be able to uh, one-shot the Magnet Division with the Valtant Warrior next turn. Looks like it, it's not even needed. <clears throat> I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep the goal. Uh, the goal. Uh, I have to check my graveyard quickly. So we have one unit in there. We probably don't want to eat that. Uh, Naglfar would be nice to have. Mm, I don't know. Okay, this is excellent. Uh, we can push with this. No 
<laughs> Why do you have two of everything? Two Goliaths, two Osrels. This is fine, but why do you have two of those? I kind of want to play neutral early. Before we start playing any big dudes. Well, that way he's going to be a 7. Kind of. Just do it. He probably doesn't have a weapon. Hey, Kahir! You're playing big monsters. It's a very... Um, <coughs> um, difficult strategy to execute. It's definitely not about just spamming uh, big dudes on the board. And later eating those big dudes. It's it's a very nuanced strategy. Oh crap. Uh, let's just play the giant. You best yield now. Mm, it's only a seven. Hmm. Can he kill this somehow? Okay, let's just let's just play Goliath. I don't really want to take the chance that uh, the count will leave me for this uh, uh, woman, a seer banana hit. Oh, oh, we got lucky. Big dudes are literally old vent, relic deck. The only change being now, it doesn't suck. <laughs> also, this is the uh, one of the best ways to go against the meta. I'm not sure why he uses that. Board. Oh my god! Well, if I pass, he's gonna go to his side, right? How does it work? Every turn on turn end, move to the row with the highest unit on the battlefield. So he needs to play. I think we're good. It's gonna go to him, but it's also gonna go to me, right? 50-50? Fuck. Will he take that chance? Or we just... Oh crap, there's nothing to eat. I, I guess we're just gonna pass. Oh baby. <laughs> you need to keep playing. <laughs> Fifty-fifty. Come on, Tom. Don't be a coward. A turn end. It passed. Yeah. But wouldn't it move at the turn end? Again? I'm not sure. Now, we need to have uh, a bunch of goals and... Uh, and an Azrael. So, none of this garbage. <laughs> what the hell is this? Okay, terrible. Sure. The problem here is that I can't take the chance that he shuts down my goal. That's my only way to really win this. We know the 
So I'm just gonna play these. This is not good. That's kind of lucky. I don't know. I'm really banking on my last card. Saving me. Well played, my friend. <laughs> Big hit. Yep. Imagine if he had the last save. Well, you don't have to imagine too hard. He would have won. Look at that! We're going up! GG. Okay. We got Coogan. And I'm not sure about these Unseen Elders. Some of them are pretty damn dangerous, but other, uh, other ones are just doing weird stuff. So we'll see in which category uh, this guy falls into. At him at Gogan and apologize. Uh, no, 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 love, you're wrong. I need to at him at Gog and write him GG in the chat. But I still didn't GG him. Just a little bit rubbing it in that I didn't GG him. Just, just, just write GG. Exactly my point. Just, just write GG. No need to press it. Uh oh. So, we don't have uh, a lot of value generation here other than the Archispor. There's an okay chance to get out Imbralet. Not amazing, but okay. The new GG button is a little bit awkward to uh, press. Are you guys used to it, or...? I'm kinda curious what you guys think about it. Maybe maybe I just get more used to it, because I did take uh, a break for uh, a couple of months from the game. Getting to work. But my initial impression about it is that in the... Well, the old button was like super easy. You repressed it every time. At least that's what I did. But the new button... Uh, I don't know. I just uh, tend to just skip it. It's the same thing. Every single enemy does the same bloody thing. So, I think we're just gonna go Nago far. Uh, that's what we want. Slam that Imbralit. Hopefully he doesn't die. <clears throat> Why are the witches so damn popular still? I don't get it. Ooh, that could be dangerous. But that's random. Randomly against me. I don't have to eat Goliath right now. I can just go with this. And that's good enough to hit the rider. So we're gonna eat Goliath. Okay, we're getting closer to getting in the lead. 
Uh, we're just gonna hit and boost by a little bit. Let's go with that. Three months old GG button. Yeah, I already used that. <clears throat> I don't think it's a good design. Fight me. Oh boy. All spirit would be nice. Ah, oh, cool is really good, but not right now. Wow. So I have all the finishers. Uh, I think I gotta push him. It's a little bit awkward against the uh, Unsealed Adder because uh, the death fish ability can be used every turn. Yeah, that's annoying. Like, he's gonna just do that. Blow up anything. And there's an okay chance that we're gonna lose a card. I don't know, it's tricky to fight. Especially if he pulls this crap. But of course, this is really annoying. Last round as well. And you can't kill it. I suppose this is more annoying with my strategy because uh, I, I tend to have uh, not many uh, trash units nearby, but I only have the big units. Lowest enemy. You're not fighting a legend over this Gwent version. Oh, come on! That's a really good combo. Time I taught you some respect. Oh, we can eat his Goliath? <laughs> oh man. Brought my old spear tip. <laughs> oh man. I think we just gotta pass. Nah, we gotta pass. <clears throat> so. We have pretty good uh, units on the menu. Yeah. These are gonna be pretty bad. Yeah, but this is decent. Let's just pass. We'll force out... Oh, come on! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Kogan! Who taught you to play like that? He was baited so hard! <laughs> it didn't really... Oh my god. This is too funny. Ah, oh, fucking that that that's how you two guys. GG. Coogan.